looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now look no further than my sponsor mutt coin bank guys you seriously cannot beat that value i promise use code poodle for five percent off your order what's going on everybody it's poodle back with another madden ultimate team video guys and today we're gonna be going over all upcoming month mutt content for this upcoming week now obviously on most calendars sunday starts the week which is why i typically do it on this day because i feel like saturday is the last day of the month week right in my personal opinion just because saturday is the last day of content right it's legends then sunday is like our reset of the week and then we get into the next week that's how i have about like i mean that's kind of the real the 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 way people view it in real life too you know sundays uh, you know if you're a school a nine to five worker then maybe sunday is your last day of the week if you look at the calendar it's the first day but for my purposes i usually consider sunday the first like transition it's like a transition day right so today's gonna be us going over that now we have a few things right so we had the easter promo drop this week a bit earlier than we would have expected also known as the sugar rush promo now in terms of last year the easter promo actually came out i believe after golden tickets so they did reverse a few things now the first thing though guys is that golden tickets although although many people may think they're late and they, even in my head i think they're late if you really if you played madden long enough you know that golden tickets really never were a huge drop in the month of march right that was last year because i think they you know last year with covid and everything they want to just end that game early like well even before covid right they were focusing on next gen but then covid was the excuse but they didn't know covid was going to happen you know it didn't make sense but they wanted to kill that game early it was very obvious what they did was they gave us one of the end game of the all end games that's the fine end game um promos known as golden tickets and they gave it to us in march said here here's the baby binky here's the bottle enjoy it and that's the end of it right but this year, I don't think they plan to do that. I mean, from what I'm looking at, it seems like they actually want to drag this game out a little bit longer than usual. So if they can do that, you know, properly and give us golden tickets like in late April or May, that'd be a much better thing anyways for the month community as a whole. So I really hope they go that way. Before we get into the rest of the video, give this video a big thumbs up. Go down below. Subscribe. Turn on the notification bell if you guys are new. And if you haven't already, comment down below. Let me know what's the number one golden ticket that you guys would make if you had the options to make one. And of course, head over to my coin bank down below and use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. Super cheap coins. Take advantage. Link will be down below in the description. Now, moving on. Here's the thing, right? So we have the Easter promo right now, right? So if we go over to the Easter promo, we had some pretty good players. You know, the, the Masters weren't exactly like banger, banger because of the positions, right? Like a running back with 95 speed is pretty good on next gen. I play current, so it doesn't affect me too much. And then it was like, okay, so then the next player is going to be a middle linebacker. Almost no one uses middle linebackers anymore. So it's just how it goes, right? So I do expect, though, that we will be getting a 98 overall LTD, a few of them at least, for the Easter promo as well. So, guys, I do expect to, like this upcoming week to look out for some LTDs. I don't know who they can give us, right? It's the Easter promo. There is no rhyme or reason for the players we get. As far as I've known, at least, right? Like, in my personal experience, Easter is one of those promos where they just pick anyone. Now, I hope this is where they bring Saquon Barkley, right? Wouldn't that make sense? A guy that didn't play in regular season, got hurt, still a great player, still loved in the Muck community. Give us a card here, right? Give us a 98 overall LTD Sugar Rush Saquon Barkley. That gets to 99 speed. 99. He'll be like a golden ticket, right? I already know Saquon will be absolutely crazy. So I do hope they do go ahead and give us a LTD Saquon. Now, of course, there's other stuff to this promo, guys. This isn't the only stuff, you know, because this isn't going to be, you know, this promo is not, I'm not saying this will be like, you know, 15 parts, but there's going to be more stuff, right? We know that because there's an Easter egg hunt. There's stuff in there as well. Eggs will eventually open. So do expect that as well, you know, as far as eggs and more, more, you know, more info regarding that as the week goes on. So the Easter promo will kind of just be unraveling this week. So expect that. Now, guys, seriously, I do expect word of, uh, before we go back to these, I do expect word of golden tickets in the upcoming, you know, week or so. I do think they're finally going to give us at least a hint or something, guys. It's been too long. I, they don't have to say they're coming, but they could at least say, you know, they will be in it this year or uh, we, we, have, we don't have a targeted release date yet or just something, right? Give us something to work with. Now, guys, obviously, once golden tickets come, as you guys know, like, they'll dominate this market so the, the moment we hear word of golden tickets the best thing i can tell you guys to do is probably sell off some of your super expensive players like a javon curse or you know tom brady anyone in this range over here like darius Slade, just start selling them off a little bit because as soon as golden tickets come out they're going to be anything these cards are times two so they won't they'll still hold value in the meantime because those cards obviously won't come out for a little bit but once they do come out guys you're not gonna get that value back so i would definitely you know just stay tuned for that guys we're we're, we're, we're right there 98s are really crazy you know really expensive right now because again they own the market we are the 99 barrage is about to happen guys i promise you it is about to happen it's about to come down strong it, like it's going to be coming in for all angles we're about to start getting 99 overall players so we're going to the ultimate legends that did just drop they gave us 98s again right so how many weeks of 98s is this one right one two three four oh look i missed this math didn't i one Sorry, two. Right, there's three of them, right? Sorry. One, two, 
I'm messing this up, guys. I can't count. Point is, there's been like three to four weeks of this, right? Okay. Disregard. My eyes are not working right now. There's been like three to four weeks of this, of 98 overalls. So what that says, we are dangerously close to a 99 transition week. Now, they may actually drag this one out a little bit longer to avoid that. But they already can be powered up to 99, so it's not like they're going to be hiding anything by not doing it, right? So, expect that we will be getting a barrage of 99, so we're going to be getting 99 Ultimate Legends, 99 LCDs, we're going to be getting, uh, you know, 99 promos. So, Golden Ticket's going to be 99, of course. I think the next promo will probably be the draft. That's going to include 99s, of course. Maybe some 99 LTDs. It's going to be all around 99s pretty soon, so just know that the 98 market is not going to be what it once was. Know that it's going to eventually cripple down a little bit. The 98 market is going to die off and just be another, you know, side market for everyone, right? Like this 98 market right here, you can see the lowest overall, the lowest, the worst of the worst in here are over 300k to 400k right here, right? That's kind of what you're looking at for these players. These are going to drop dead. And of course, guys, even worse, if you have a 96, 97 overall player, this market's going to be shattered into the 100k range that's what happens if you guys like i said if you played long enough you know that the the thing right around like right around now march april ish that's when we start to transition to 99s once we transition to 99s people just completely like that that's when all these cards will start going for like 80 to 150k 200k at the highest and then all the 98 overalls will be like 100k 150k 200k again and that's when we end up seeing like you know 99 overall players for 300k now that's more going towards may and late april in the short period of time 99s will be super expensive 98s will drop a drop 99s will be super expensive and then of course as we get into may that's when everything should just start coming because again 99s will be expensive when there's the first few 99s they'll be expensive when there's a you know a few 99s they're going to be moderate when there's a bunch of them and then eventually we're going to be so watered down with 99s that we're going to have like bad 99s you know what i mean like there's going to be something that's a bad 99 right so like we'll have 99 overall you know uh blank blank and then we'll have 99 overall jerry rice now this jerry rice only gets you know 98 speed and his uh he's not, he's not the most elusive or whatever anything right and it's like, oh, well, I'd rather just go with the 99 speed guy. And that's where you start getting bad 99s. Or you get a pass rusher 99 who has like a 75 speed uh, defensive tackle or something. It's like, that's a bad 99. He's going to start dropping. So eventually, we're going to start getting the differentials, like, differentials of 99s. And that's going to kind of be when you see the market separating. But yeah, we have a lot. We have some stuff coming. We got Easter still, of course, the eggs, LTDs. We do have a golden ticket at some point. We have the NFL draft. Again, the draft, you still have some time on, although it didn't, it usually drops a little bit before the draft of course and then of course we also have some draft easter golden ticket news at some point i don't know exactly what date i don't know exactly what time but it has to be coming soon right you have to imagine and then of course guys as well we do have what's pretty important is going to be what surprise promo in between right because we have that space promo that's still you know lingering somewhere now those could all be summer promos because that's what they could be it could be like late spring early summer promos that they want to have there for us to elongate this game but I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, that is about for the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. So remember, stay tuned for the uh, unraveling of the Easter promo. Some eggs, some golden ticket news, some LTDs, and 99 overall players. So that's going to be a big transition pretty soon. I mean, of course, we all knew that one was coming. But it was just a matter of when. They seem to have pushed it back a little bit longer. But like I said, my, my I always told them my estimate for um, 99s was always the first week of April. It was like, if at the bare minimum... The last few days of March and at the worst, second week of April. But I think it'll be the first week of April. It's looking like that's going to be at like around April 7th. Anywhere between April 7th and April 1st, probably we're going to end up seeing our first batch of a bunch of 99s, right? That's about it, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. I'm out. Subscribe, turn the notification bell. If you guys need coins, head over to my coin bank down below and use code PUDO for 5% off. I'm out. Peace.